People have been charged in that homicide in Bradford County. Newswatch 16's Mackenzie Auker explains the new details revealed today. Law enforcement officials gathered at the Bradford County Courthouse to go over details of a grisly murder. It's a crime so shocking that the district attorney may push for the death penalty. The fact that a one-year-old child was present at the time of the death of Michael Pruitt, that could be an aggravating circumstance to justify the Commonwealth seeking the death penalty in this case. According to investigators, Michael Pruitt was killed just over a week ago at a home in Springfield Township near Columbia Crossroads. Troopers have charged Terry Parker, Rhonda Parker, and Summer Heil in connection with the death. Troopers say Pruitt was lured to the home, shot, and eventually dismembered. They say text messages from Rhonda to other people, including a pastor, led to them being called to the property. Mere hours after receiving this information, our troopers were able to identify and locate the scene of this horrific crime here in Bradford County. Our troopers were able to identify human remains at that crime scene. Terry and Rhonda Parker were arrested in the early morning hours on Tuesday, March 12th. They are charged with criminal homicide along with abuse of a corpse and tampering with evidence. Terry Parker's girlfriend, Summer Heil, is accused of abuse of a corpse and tampering with evidence. She told state troopers Terry Parker was angry because he believed Pruitt had exposed himself to children. I can confirm today that those allegations of purported sexual acts by the victim had not been previously reported to state police, they had not been reported to Childline, and they had not been reported to any other law enforcement agency. I suspect down the road, uh, after consultation with these other attorneys, that we'll probably have a, a larger scale preliminary hearing probably held here in the Bradford County Courthouse to accommodate the number of attorneys and the number of parties involved in that hearing. That preliminary hearing is currently scheduled for later this month. The district attorney expects to decide after that if he will seek the death penalty in this case. Mackenzie Auker, Newswatch 16, Bradford County.